G'day friends, welcome back to the channel. Well today is Wonderland Day, the day that I'm determined to get my weight under 200 pounds. Now there's been a, a series of setbacks this morning. I woke up, I weighed myself and I was So that 91.35 get below 200 pounds I think I have to be 90.71 or less so I I I sat on the toilet nothing much happening there the uh, the old bowels were rather recalcitrant didn't do anything uh, to speak about um, I took my watch off, I took my teeth out, I cut my toenails, I cut my fingernails, I had a shave, I even gave the, the old chest a bit of a, a manscape, and we even went even lower than that and went down to a forbidden zone where not only did I manscape, I actually deforested the whole area in that in the vain attempt to try and get a bit more weight uh, off. Now, according to TikTok, uh, once you uh, do, do deforest that area down there, it's supposed to make everything else look more impressive. But sadly, it just made it look more sad and lonely. So that was a bit of a waste of time. So... Even after all that, I've got down to 90.9. 90.9, that's still 0.2 of a kilo off the target. I still can't get under 200 pounds. Now, if you'll look over there in the corner, you can see the scales lurking with a smug, self-satisfied look on their faces because they think that they've beaten me. But it's not going to happen. Now, most people would be defeated now. They'd be saying, because I have to do this on, this is a Sunday. I have to do it today because it's the only day I'll get the house to myself to make a video. But uh, I've had a brainwave. I have a cunning plan. You're coming with me. Wait till you see what the plan is. In fact, put in the comments down below. If you can think of where I'm going and what I'm about to do to lose a bit more weight. And it's not walking. It's not a sauna. It won't be involving uh, sweating. I certainly won't be uh, regurgitating anything or taking huge amounts of laxatives. So just put it down in the comments what you think I'm about to do. Okay. We're off on our weight loss quest. Here we are. Now, do you think you're going to work out where we are and what I'm about to do? There it is. We're going to go and try and give some blood. That will be 0.5678 of a kilogram. I'm a little bit nervous, to be honest. Here we are. Now well, here we go, we're giving blood. Well, I was very brave. I didn't need Teddy. Okay, back home. Let's see if it made any difference. 500 mils or half a kilo. Here's fingers crossed. That 
$199.65. And there it is. £199.849. We're under 200. Welcome to Wonderland. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Well, the plan worked. 90.65. Now, in non scale victories, my BMI is now down to. 29.8 which just puts me in the overweight category and out of the obese category so i'm pretty happy with that uh, i'll just turn this around i don't know if you'll be able to see this but no brace on i've taken the brace off it's been six weeks um yeah i'm pretty well um done with the brace for now um, I've been walking the last few days and uh, it's sore at night and I have overdone a little bit. I did 10 k's yesterday. It was too much. Today I'm having a rest day. Sunday I'm not doing anything. I told you my BMI was 29.8. My body fat is now 29.2 and my muscle has gone up to 35.7. So body fat's gone down. Muscle mass has gone up. I'll just show you that. can see that other non-scale victory is I've been managed I can now do four just about four unassisted pull-ups on the pull-up bar without the uh, without the straps to help which is a massive improvement because uh, uh, in the last week I could only do three so as my weight goes down my strength is increasing so I'm hoping but by the end of the year, I'm hoping to be able to do 10 of those. And another another win that I've had, I won't show because it's not very pretty, but I've got an old pair of jeans. I've, I don't know how many years old they are, but three years ago, I could fit into those comfortably. Last week, I couldn't even get I couldn't even get it past couldn't even get them past my hips. Today, I can get them past my hips and with another couple of inches off my waist, I'd be able to. I could just about get the button done up. Now it's still a fair way to go. Pr still another seven or eight kilos before they're going to uh, fit comfortably. But uh, yeah, it's still encouraging. You know, it's still a win. So I'm. I grab these wins and I hold them to my chest wholeheartedly because uh, you've got to. Because some weeks it's not going to go your way. And you need those winds to fall back on to, as reassurance. Okay, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the encouraging support and uh, positive comments from everybody. Very much appreciated. I hope you have a wonderful week. Uh, looks like the weather's going to get pretty chilly here, but uh, it's supposed to be sunny. So I'm hoping to get out and do a bit of fishing or kayaking or doing something now that I've got the brace off my leg. Obviously, you're not, you know, I wasn't going to go paddling around in the kayak with that big heavy brace on because if you tip the, if you tipped it over and you end up in the water you're not going to be able to swim you know you're going to sink like a stone so even for, for my level in incompetence and stupidity that wasn't going to be a go anyway till the next one uh stay safe and uh yeah enjoy the rest of your week